Hey guys, what's going on? I am here with a uh, unboxing of an Xbox One. I just got this, picked it up at my local store, and yeah, let's get into this. Got a box cutter right here. And let's open this puppy up. Turn it so you guys can see it. And this is what it'll look like when you guys get one. So what we got here is just your normal paperwork and warranty stuff, probably. Here's a Xbox One mic. We'll look at that later. Here's the power cord. Here's the other part of the power cord. Actually, yeah, this is part of it. It's very boxy, just like the Xbox One. And here's the controller. We'll just, uh, comes with batteries too. Look at that slick thing. Feels pretty nice in the hands. Gotta get used to it though. What do we got here? Oh, here's an HDMI cable. And then take this tray off to get to the real goods. It's like Christmas morning. Alright, and I can already imagine they are going to come out with a smaller version of this. Cause this thing is a damn beast. <laughs> Alright, let's put all this boxing crap away. Alright, so here it is. Get a nice reflection of my baseball fan. Has the Xbox One right there. Or Xbox, at least. And on the back here, you got your HDMI out, HDMI in, your power source, two USBs, thing for the connect, which no one will use. This will be a dusty hole, just like my X. And here is an Ethernet cable and an IR in, or out. I've never used these IR infrareds. And an S slash PDIF port. I have no idea what that is. Anywho, here's the nice front. Uh, like the old ones, you don't have the tray anymore. It just eats it up like the old uh, PS3 and stuff. Looks pretty good. Got to rip this stupid HDMI thing off. Here's the bottom. Nothing too special. It's going to look pretty slick. Now, I don't know if this has just... Oh, and here's a... another USB, it looks like. This one, I don't know what an SS has like a weird SS symbol on it. Oh, that's too dark. You guys can't even see. But right there it says SS with the USB thing. I'm not sure what that means. But yeah, it actually looks like the Xbox is just st stays like this. There's no flipping it this way or anything. But I got my other Xboxes here. Let's take a look at it, kind of. So here's the old... Everyone remembers the f first gen. This is actually my Halo, Halo 3 version with a bunch of stickers on it. And so this is what this compares to. It's actually much smaller <laughs> already than the Xbox One. So there's that. And then here's the new version. Let me get this in frame so you guys can actually see. And so here's the new version or the newer Xbox 360 on top. So you got your Xbox One, your first gen Xbox 360, and then your second gen Xbox 360. Now let's hold these up here. Now I know the Xbox One doesn't go like this, but I'll just show you for the sake of it. And it looks like there's a button right here for eject. This is your eject button for your Xbox One. 
Let me get this in frame one more time. <laughs> Not very good at this. There we go. That gives you a little perspective of what this looks like. Move this thing back a little bit and up. There we go. Now here's the Xbox One 360 first gen and then the second gen 360. So yeah, it's uh this one. It definitely seems like it weighs a lot less though. Even though this is big, even this seems a lot heavier than uh, the Xbox One. I wanted you guys to sh uh, see this, the headset that came with it. Um, it's pretty, uh, pretty nice actually. It has like a very minimal design, just like the Xbox One. And I don't know if you can see this, but um, get this chair out of my way. This comes down right here. Very nice looking, and this is also bendy like the Xbox 360 version, how it could bend around like that, which is nice. At first I was looking at it and I wasn't sure if it was bendy because it looks all hard plastic, but I was like, eh, let's see if this thing can really bend, and it sure does. And then it has a, a flat cord, comes down. Here's your control button. You got your big mute and mute button right here. Let me get the light on that. Here's your mute, and then your volume up, and then your volume down. And then uh, it just goes into your old Xbox One controller, like the Xbox 360. Just push that in like so. That's what this will be looking like. And this thing also has a weird, uh, it looks weird when you adjust it. Like this whole thing goes down and the circle thing just moves. It's really crazy. So if you got a small head, you'd be looking like this. If you got a big head, you'd be way down like that. It's really cool how they designed that. You don't see that too much. Hope you guys liked my unboxing of the... Xbox One and the comparison to the other original Xbox 360s. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.